This is a limited edition of one of Liebherr's largest mobile cranes, it's the LTM 1500, which is a 500 ton crane. It's a big model and it comes in a big box, and it's all contained within factory sealed trays. The model is in the colours of White Crane Hire, which is a Scottish company which started business in 1983. Let's lift the lid and that will give us our first sight of the attractive yellow and green colour scheme. This model comes with the usual instruction manual and it's very good with a parts list and plenty of photos to explain how to assemble it. Out of the box this model comes with the option of an 84 meter boom and there's also the wire guy attachment that can be fitted plus of course a hook. The assembly has been covered in previous LTM 1500 videos so here we've got it all assembled and the only thing we need to attach is the ladder that goes onto the crane cab. For this model we'll take a good look at the high level of detail and that starts underneath with a very detailed chassis. It includes tanks and hoses and the wheels are very good, with the tyres having branding in the sidewalls and different hubs depending on whether the axle is driven or not. The driving cab is very good with a number plate and the Scottish flag also appears on the front. Behind the cab there's a nice mesh grille and sharp graphics on the sides. A particular high point of these models is the detail and there's some very small graphics such as these ones. And there are more on the rear outriggers. But it's not just graphics, there are some very tiny grills and bolt head details also. And on the crane body there are some pleasingly small details within the casting. Also on the crane there are some more fine details such as these tiny graphics. And the crane cab is also very detailed with a nice interior and leap hair on the seat back. The pulleys on the model are all metal and this version includes a large black spooling drum on the boom. At the back of the crane the luffing winch assembly is already reeved in the factory and there's plenty of hydraulic hoses to add detail. At the back the Liebherr name is nicely embossed in the castings. The Y guy arrangement is nearly all metal with just the hydraulic ram jackets being plastic and very slightly off colour. The telescopic boom sections have a very realistic fin wall profile with white crane printed on every section. Also included with the model are three excellent different sized metal hooks and they're decorated in complementary colours. If you want to see a full review of the features have a look at a previous video of this model. But for now we'll just have a quick look at some of the features. Each of the axles has a good sprung suspension and you can set the steering to moderate angles. If we push the crane along all of the tyres are reasonably well grounded, with just some minor wobbles when moving in a straight line where some of the steering axles are slightly loose. If we make an attempt to set the steering then we can push the model in a very shallow curve. Certainly this crane is not going to drive you around the bend. The metal outrigger beams are able to hold the model wheels free and they've got nice smooth pistons and matching spreader plates. If you prefer you could also display them at half extension. With the outriggers set up we need to stop the crane driver looking back all of the time. And the way to achieve that is to rotate the crane cab so that it faces the front. It was quite stiff on the review model which was a little bit unusual. But at least if the driver was inside the cab he wouldn't be flung out at high speed. Next we can raise the big heavy boom. And it goes up smoothly because the main boom rams are made of metal. When you've got the boom at the angle you want you can then secure it in position. And to do that you use a supplied key to tighten up two grub screws which are fitted into the top of the ram jackets. It's all a nice high quality system. Now we get a chance to play crane driver. The counterweight and luffing winch has been delivered by a nice ballast trailer which is in the white colour scheme. And that's a WSI model that was released in 2012. So the luffing winch is all rigged up with chains. 
and we can use the key in the winch to lift the load. The winch on this model is not as smooth as that you'll find because of the way the winch brake has been configured, but it holds the load easily and then we can gently swing it round. On the review model the rotation had some stiffness, but that just goes to test the crane driving skills. The winch needs to be fitted on top of the counterweight so we need to luff the boom in. And then we can go for some more winch action to lower it on top of the counterweight. And there we see the banksman steadying the load with his giant hand. The other feature we'll take a look at in this video is the Y guy arrangement. And this is used to provide extra support to the boom head so it increases the lifting capacity. Using the key again you can adjust the tension. So you can stiffen up and equalise the Y guy arrangement. The Liebherr LTM 1500 by WSI Models is a great crane model, and this version in the colours of William White really looks excellent. It's a very nice colour scheme, the model's got great detailing, and most of the functionality is very good, so overall this model is outstanding. 